So, when we pitch, we know we will be if it is an assignment, if you are out to get an assignment, then we, when we are pitching, you will be roughly have an idea of what shots you are going to get and what story you want to tell. But they all know after after some after you are recognized in the na international market, they will they know that okay, this fellow can deliver. If this is not the exact story, what he is going to deliver, it can be slightly different, but he will be able to deliver the story. So, we do not assure them with 100 pages, we just assure them with one page, just one page. So, one in one page story, you when you work on it, work on it again and again. When you are working with the other guys, experts, then they will make you work so hard, you will bring it down to just skeleton. That is why they will ask you for a one page story. One page story will be really difficult to write. So, you bring it down to one page and say exactly what you can really deliver and do not say many things. At the same time, the story should make sense. In uncontrolled documentary, it is not easy to tell the story in advance, but with experience, you, you will be able to say some story and that is why we do a lot of research before any, any films. So, that we will get an idea of what we are going to do and we are not going to push that film into that story. We are going to let the story take its course, but uh, as we know the thread, the thread will uh, remain the same. Upakatagal bandok they will be going around and if you are skilled, you will be able to bring back the thread back to the story. You just may be a little bit of tweak. So, many times our uh, documentaries will be almost 95 to 96 percent completely true to everything. Like if I show a dog and tell him that this is the dog, the, this is the particular dog or you name a dog or you whatever it is and that will be the particular animal. You will not be cheating on anything internationally. You will be, you, your doors will close if you, so many times your doors can close. So many people survive by cheating. But uh, especially when you are a brown and you are from a third world country, you are not from England, you are not from America, you should do any cheating, you are anything like anything like in our days we were shooting in 16 mm and the beginning 16 mm roles would come from there and if we, if, if one of the role is missing, if it is an assignment we are shooting and sending it back, then uh, if there is one role missing and uh, they will not notice it, but uh, similar shots which they have used from us is a sister shot or a cut away is here. And then, if it is used in another film, you are finished. Your career will get close because the commissioners are not many. There is a very small community, like 150 people. Uh, the uh, news will go like this, and uh, oh, these guys are not reliable. That is the end of it. So many people have lost. Indians have lost their career for five, six years, and they have come out the back door again. And the people will change. The commissioners will change. So you take a back door and come. That's a bad way of doing it. And it doesn't work. Sorry, yes. Sir, yeah, sir, talking in this time frame, uh, you were saying uh, most of our documentary filmmaking is to show the realistic of the society or whatever in general. So, uh, when we are going for a documentary filmmaking, are we supposed to have a script with us or are we supposed to shoot whatever we want to shoot with a basic theme, right? And later with, the foot with that footage, are we supposed to do a script? What do you prefer to have a script in with you or? One the major problem in the scripted scripted. Scripted and then you basically researched elements it could mark. How flat are the document? You observe Mark Kondo, Yandra Adikastundu, soul you're allowing. Real soul. Matter Allah. अधिक इवन अनकंट्रोल्ड है इधर ला फर्स्ट न्यू स्केलिटन इधर ला रियल प्रॉब्लम है नंता न्यू वर्गडे वोट को वोट आठ कोण बगाते हैं इश्यू अधिक कौन द सुमने सिंपल एक्साम्पल निम्न के एक सेना निम्बत्ते निम्न नारेट मारता है ये निम्न द मुंद कड़े वन द वन द इलों द नदियाँ रीतला � Okay, ni u ni campus ada ke barat tala, adri pakai tu anu film mard kuli itu, nani ni assignment kuli tu, hek mard tera, hek mard tu ni u head back. Basically interaction tau ni tera. Ini documentary, are you from journalism or environmental science? Environmental science. Is it okay we are talking to talking about documentary based talking in Canada? 
Alla, alla. Basically, he is just giving you an assignment. Like you have equipment, and uh, the subject is right next to your uh, campus. And uh, if it is uh, a film about Rishabhavati, how do you go about it? How do you give it treatment to it? We have not thought about it. We, while just coming, he said, uh, what is the name of this river? I said, I think it is Rishabhavati. This is where all the love, everything takes place, right next to those falls and beautiful places around Arkavati. And we are just laughing and coming. So suddenly now he has thought of something. So we have not discussed about it. So, how do you so give me some time to think and you think and tell me how would you make a film around Rishabhavati? Okay, now that we don't have time to think, we'll, I'll give you an example of how you can go about it. Like you do a lot of research around the rivers. Maybe when you think bigger, it can be just about water. Slightly smaller, it can be rivers. So what is happening, you can still thinking bigger, what is happening around the world about water? So there is a saying that the next world war will be for water. Oh, the next world war can be water. So what are the symptoms? Where is it going? Why would people fight for the water? Oh, we have shortage of fresh water uh, resources. And we have global warming. No, I'm just going through this. It's just a exercise for myself. I'm just thinking loud. So global warming can be a factor. So what does what what does it mean? Oh, the erratic rainfall. So if the erratic rainfall is there, the the water, if uh, Bangalore is getting 30 inches of rain every year, average, it might start getting 50 inches of rain. And in the Western Ghat, where 200 inches of rainfall was supposed to fall it might come down to 100 inches. So what happens? So what happens? The farmers will get completely confused. The smaller farmers in the Western Ghats, you might know in the Western Ghats, there are more plantation than the forest. Natural ecosystem is almost gone and all plantation. But it has all happened hundreds of years back. You cannot, re you cannot reverse it. So how do we go about this? So what happens if the erratic rainfall? Erratic rainfall happens and the small farmer will get strangled. Just imagine suddenly small things like uh, there is a recession in US. We have nothing to do with that. But this small farmer will definitely get affected. So it is just a thought process. Okay, suddenly there is a civil war in uh, Africa. How, what nonsense are you talking? We are talking about Vrishabhavati. Hey, let us come to Vrishabhavati. At the same time, what, which are the rivers which are alive today? Most of them are like Vrishabhavati. It has that color, that is why you see. Otherwise, most of the <laughs> rivers are not palatable today. So, why not we expand our thought to the whole of rivers, whole set of rivers? Then we think of, uh, because we are all from south of Karnataka, we all think of Kaveri. Oh, Kaveri, there is conflict. So, what is the catchment for Kaveri? So, when you, so now I got the future of uh, uh, Kaveri here. So, you get the past somewhere. You find the past. So, Kaveri can become Rishabhavati any time. Because the US recession can affect, or even demonetization can affect a small farmer. Suddenly, he does not know what to do in the picking season. If he does not have money, he does not know what to do. Exactly, it happened like that. That is why I remembered. Uh, somewhere in November, the demonetization happened. The picking season is November, December, January for the small uh, Coffee farmers. Picking. Coffee picking uh, farmers, they need a lot of money. It is cash flowing time, the cash time. Because labors will come from distance. They do not have bank account, nothing. That you have to pay them cash. So, suddenly no money. Hey, what am I going to do? He will cut the tree. He will cut his own shade trees. That will affect the cashment. That will affect the cashment. That will affect the cover in, uh, in the long run. So, suddenly, oh, this is what might have happened to Rishabhavati. So, now suddenly you think, okay, how do I treat it? Okay, shall I treat it as uh, uh, my professor has said that, okay, do a documentary on this. You go and sit there for some time, uh, talk to him and all those things. Okay, you shoot that like this, like this and one drone shot and now you have drone, you have drone shot and finish up. Then, what do I do next? 
you have some, uh, you know, some lovers are sitting next to it. How do you feel? It? They feel, you know, it's terrible, but we don't have a private place anywhere else. That's why we are sitting. Oh, that's a, that's a beautiful thing. Actually, you can include in the film. But suddenly, su suddenly, if you treat it like a murder mystery, what happens? No, this is beautiful. It's sudden thought. This is a sudden thought process. Like, if you treat the documentary on Rishabhati as a murder mystery, what happens? Backbench is a bore. It's 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 a You can tell me straight on the face. It's a bore. Is it okay? Yes, sir. So, Rishabhati story is Okay, you got your answer now. You have a one line story. Rishabhavati River as a murder mystery. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> yeah, no, just treat it like a human being. And slowly killed by somebody. Like who has taken away the hand? Who, who has killed the who has the cut the legs? Oh, what a torturous time it might have gone through. And then somebody has cut the head itself off. Then, you know the future. Then, the ghost of Rishabhati can be haunting Bangalore. <laughs> Beautiful, no? You got the treatment straight away. Most thrilling. Nothing doing. This is, this, is, this is just the treatment. The same thing can be handled as a documentary. It's not like a fiction. Is it not real that it had a past, it has, it has a future, it is a haunting uh, Bangalore like a ghost. So, it was killed by somebody and was killed in such and such an year. Just think about it, you will love it. <laughs> then you come to Jibbo, Nimbo, Drono, GoPro, Ella Bunny. First day in Altare, a film or three, one film, Katheta, the insert. Namatar Tumbajanaban, some Katha discuss Malak, but regular fiction. Storytelling, we are trained for a many, many years. We have worked under many British producers, some of the finest that they work Madi, so we are trained. So you are a bandu Kathi Halak Bartharan. Our Shurmada, the Jibu, the Barthas of Hashata, Anta. That's not the way. Why can't you tell me one line story? Or just catch my eyeballs and that. eyeballs and that. Our language only. You television only. Is just not there and that. You catch my attention first. You catch my eyeballs. Hang pitch mar thei and that. La inge. So it is not a fiction. It is a documentary. So you have the past. You have the future. You have the present. So you begin. Have a mid and a good end. So, you just have to then do more research. Now, I have no clue about it, I have just seen it. Just go with an open mind now. What could be the past? So, how treatment is how you treat it. Like you can straight away say, Rishabhati flows from here to here and it was once upon a time it was a good river now because of all the pollution and so many people are coming to Bangalore and it will become a drainage like thing. But still, unfortunately, youngsters find no other private place, so they come and sit right, right next to it. They look at it like a beautiful falls, and, but for us, it is a dirty, smelly water hole. So, that is one way of doing it. But you can also make, it is all about, see, your viewers, you tell the truth, but how you, how you say it. I am not asking you to deviate from the truth, it is not a fiction. So, how you say it? So, basic one-line treatment for this is, I will treat the Rishabhati Nadi story as a murder mystery. You get my, you get my attention straight away. Okay, come on, sit down, tell me what it is. So, then you can think about how you present it to me. No? That's how things work. That's what, that is the answer to whatever she asked. <laughs>